G'day YouTube, this is my quick, cheap and nasty and completely unscripted review of the latest release of Kubuntu uh, 18.04. Now I'll get straight into it, so basically Kubuntu of course is the uh, the release of Ubuntu that uses the KDE Plasma desktop environment, as you can see current release 5.12. It's been in the fives for some time now, but that's okay. Now, getting into it, let's see a few things. So, starting off the desktop environment, as mentioned, KDE version there. We the window, the window manager or the the file manager, sometimes called. We'll have a look at that as well. It's actually the Dolphin uh, file manager, which has been around for some time on the KDE or the Kubuntu uh, desktop there as well. So, let's have a look, see if we can find out any information about that one version 17.12.3 so I don't personally use a uh, Kubuntu or KDE that much or Dolphin the file manager for that much but uh, looks pretty much uh, the same as I've seen in previous uh, iterations I suppose you could say now the the most common uses for Kubuntu is uh, really just uh, just je desktop usage uh, the thing that sets Kubuntu apart from other desktop environments of course is the uh, I guess the graphical interface uh, you could almost say a little bit uh, Windows-esque in, in the way that they go about things it is a uh, resource heavy so I wouldn't uh, recommend using it on a smaller lighter laptop or older machine that sort of thing but it is uh, in a way uh, set for the power users who do have a lot of uh, resources to go around to splash around on the desktop that sort of thing uh, with uh, or with all Kubuntu releases it's got its uh, own K version of a lot of uh, software so we'll see here we've got this uh, K for contacts, uh, contact personal information manager. We've got K system guard, which is the system monitor. Uh, console with a K, so this is, is pretty much their branded way of doing things, kind of like uh, anything Apple or uh, Microsoft, they all do that sort of thing themselves as well in their own ways. So uh, let's see, uh, as it is Ubuntu 18.04, it has the, uh, the one of the latest kernels at least, 4.15, which is pretty good to see there. Um, in terms of uh, actual RAM usage. It's not actually using much at the moment. This is just the live, uh, the live copy that I'm running at the moment, but uh, it's not quite installed. It, you would probably expect the RAM to be a little bit more than what we're currently seeing here, but um, again, it is uh, the most uh, RAM uh, and resource-intensive uh, Ubuntu distribution that you will find around. So that's pretty much it, guys. Just a super quick look at uh, the uh, Kubuntu desktop, uh, 18.04, the latest release. Uh, I won't get too much more into the software side of things because in my opinion you can install almost any software on almost any Linux distribution so it's not really something that I like to uh, get into there. But uh, a nice clean sort of a cut. Uh, let's have a throw down of the wallpaper, see what that looks like. This is obviously some kind of default for it. Not something I get into too much either but uh, yeah widgets galore, panels galore, uh, options galore in terms of a uh, GUI graphical user interface desktop uh, of sorts that is Kubuntu 18.04. So cheers guys, hope you've enjoyed.